Hello my dear family members if you are preparing for capgemini and if your exam is within very few days then this video will be very much helpful because in this video i am going to share today's slots coding questions and that might be repeated and that type of questions can be asked to you again so let me share the first question but before that guys if you have not subscribed this channel then please do subscribe because this motivates me to make more content okay and this doesn't cost anything so please show your big heart okay so let me show you the uh, first question so the question is this uh due to the copyright issue i have not uh, shown the full question but i hope this much of coding portion will be question portion will be enough so the question is you have to do this so the input format is abc and the output is 148 why and how i am explaining then you will get to know why this output is coming so basically what you have to do you have to reverse the uh, alphabetical order okay that means let's say for a what we have the place value that is one for b two for c three dollar for z we have 26 but you have to reverse the alphabetical order that means for z you have to place one okay that means for a you have to place 26 for b 25 for c 24 this way z will be one okay so this way you have to reverse the alphabetical order of any character and then what you have to do just check for a the order is one for b the order is serial number is two for c the serial number is three here okay so basically here and uh, like you have the position number right so one into the reverse alphabetical order of a that is 26 and so add this then 2 into the alphabetical order the reverse alphabetical order of b that is 25 then 3 into 24 so all are added then you are getting 148 okay so this is the task you have to do so let me show you the second sample input that is a b c a so in this case for a the serial is 1 2 3 and 4 right so for a the alphabetical order so 1 into 26 2 into 25 3 into 24 and again a is there right is it is not visible to you guys i know but uh, the sample input is a b c a okay so 3 into 24 and then 4 into 26 so all you have to do is just add these and you will get your desired output that is 250 two so there is another sample input i'm going to share in the upcoming time so just wait okay so guys uh i hope you understood what the task is so if you understood then please do subscribe and please try to solve the problem by yourself if you can't then please uh, watch till the end okay and you can try your this code in c plus plus and python because they might not give you the access to java so please try to solve this problem in any of this language okay so let me share you the solutions in python guys so but before that if you have not gone through these materials then please do go through this because this will help you a lot you are having like almost all things you need to prepare for like it fundamental questions pseudocode coding questions essay writing mock test game based aptitude as well assessment also interview preparation everything you are getting in this pdfs in this all uh like uh in uh, all in one bundle okay so if you want then please just go through the link given in the description box and get all of these helps okay so i hope you will do consider so just please go through the link given in the comment section or in description okay so let me show you the solutions so what approach we have followed just let me tell you that so basically what you have to do here you have to use the ascii value right so in python the function word e and if you just enter the character uh, this will give return you the ascii value of it so for small a the ascii value is 97 okay and for b the ascii value will be 98 for c it is 99 and dot dot for z it will be 122 i hope you are aware of this like oh, what is the ascii value for each characters and how to get it so for ja for uh, uh yeah for python using ord function we can get the ascii value so now the question is how to get the reverse alphabetical order of any character before getting the reverse alphabetical order we have to get the 
actual alphabetical order right that means for a we have to get one for b we have to get uh we have to get two for c we have to get the order three so this is the actual alphabetical order so we have to get that first then we can reverse that so what's the actual that is uh this so order th that means this order of this character let's say for a for a so this is the ascii value for a and order of a order of a that means also 97 plus 1 for any character for any character this is the rule that uh, let's say for b the um ascii value is 98 and order of a that is 97 plus 1 so this is the actual order of any alphabetical uh, uh, for any character uh, the alphabetical order okay so 97 minus 97 plus 1 that is 1 98 minus 97 plus 1 that is 2 so this way you can get the actual alphabetical order for any character for c you will similarly get 99 minus 97 plus 1 so this way you will get 3 so for all character you will get the actual reverse alphabetical order sorry actual uh, alphabetical order but to get the reverse alphabetical order you have to just subtract by 27 you will get the reverse alphabetical order for 1 27 minus 1 that is 26 for 2 27 minus 2 that is 25 for 3 27 minus 3 that is 24 so this way you will get all the reverse alphabetical order so let me just show you the full code so that you will get to know about that so so the code starting from here so at first we are getting the input from the user what uh what you can do that is let's say there can be a negative scenario right negative scenario means let's say there is uh an alpha alphanumeric uh, string and there may be the characters will be in uh uh capital letters so you have to just ignore those using your code so write uh, the complete code like uh like okay, let's say you have to check if the string containing any uh, capital letters or not if it is uh, alpha numeric or not so you, for those you have to just return minus one okay and uh yeah for this code so at first we have taken the input then we called and return like printed the value so this function we have called so let me go to the function so this is the function reverse ascii power so actually the name of the code uh, coding question was reverse ascii power okay so at first we are going through all the element of that uh string of that string let's say abc okay for abc we are going through all the element of the string using uh for loop okay for i in range length of s so let's say s is equal to abc at first okay string so char is equal to si that means the first character the first character of this string we are storing inside this char variable okay so then then what we do let's uh, let me just remove reverse okay and okay so uh, in this variable we are just getting the reverse uh, alphabetical order of that character so as i have shown you earlier that is order of this character order of any character order of any character that means uh, the ascii value okay the ascii value of any character minus ascii value of a ascii value of any character minus ascii value of a plus one we get here we get the actual order of the character actual uh, ascii value of the character or actual uh sorry al actual alphabetical order of the character but actually to get the reverse we have to just subtract by 27 we did it okay then the position should be also increased because the position of a is one the position of b is two the position of c is three the position of the next character is 4 right so this way you have to get the position uh, increase right so a i plus 1 this way you have to increase that so then you have to in like get the sum value the formula you have to implement that is total is equal to so you have to uh, initialize this as total is equal to 0 at the beginning then total plus is equal to reverse into positions so what that mean that is total is equal to total plus reverse into position so reverse means this value that means let's say for a that is 26 for b 25 so this way and position is uh here we got it right so uh, for the any character it is being increased uh in it in, in each iteration so it will get the position here okay so then uh so let me just uh, share that 
so reverse is equal to so let's say the character uh, string is a b c a okay so the order is one two three four right one two three four. order means position okay so the position so total is equal to total plus reverse into 26 into position 1 in the next iteration the total will be 26 okay 26 plus sorry in the next iteration 26 plus 25 into 2 okay so this way it will keep increasing the position will keep increasing so this way we will get our desired output so i hope uh, you are clear all of this so at the end just return this total will get the actual result okay so let me just run it and let me show if this is producing right output or not so uh yeah so for abc it should print 148 and for abca it should print 252 okay and okay let me just uh, take another any 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 another uh, input let's say um, let's say a b b b okay so what should be output a b b a so let me just check that a b b a b b okay so that is 251 how let me show you a b b a means 1 into 26 b means 25 right so 2 into 25 3 into 25 4 into 25 so just add it you will get this so i hope you understood uh, how we are getting the output how, how what's the logic we are using what's the syntax we have used so guys uh, at the end again i am requesting you to have this prime materials just go to the link given in the description box and grab all the things in your hand you are getting it fundamentals questions pseudo code coding questions essay writing mock test game based aptitude everything right so please do consider it and get the job in your hand so thank you